Ronik Aslanian. I'm the head of growth for Viverse here at HTC, and we're at MWC 2025. Today we're showing off uh, all the capabilities of Viverse Create and Viverse World, ranging from building multiplayer games to e-commerce, even art history world. On the one hand, we have a world editor, extremely easy to use, it's like simpler than The Sims. On the other hand, when you go the game engine route, even there, we provide no-code tools that aren't native to the game engine that we've built to lower the barrier entry even there. So if you're an artist that wants to do a complex scene but add some interactivity to it, you don't have to learn how to code. One of the ways that we enable this cross-device support is this technology that we've built called Polygon Streaming where we only stream in the assets that are currently visible at the quality that you need. And that lets you load in to experiences right away without downloading the entire package. And it even lets us render scenes with 70 million polygons, real-time lighting on all your different devices. And that's a huge differentiator for us here at Viverse. Everything that you see here is completely online and ready to go. You just go to viverse.com. From there, you'll see the different links to create, to world, to our avatar system. And you don't even have to make an account. You can distribute. 3D content as easily as you can distribute video on YouTube, and that's kind of our goal here with Viverse World.